There has been another bear sighting in Palm Beach County, this time in the PGA National neighborhood of Palm Beach Gardens. Footage of the bear was captured on a ring doorbell camera. Our Steve King joining us live from PGA National with a look at that footage and what the homeowner and other neighbors are saying about the sighting. Steve? Felicia, well, Kathy Bunella was out of town and she got a notification from her ring camera that a black bear was actually strolling across her driveway. She looked at the footage. She couldn't believe what she saw. Here's the footage from Kathy Bunello's ring camera at her new home in the Glengarry neighborhood of PGA National. I'm still a little surprised at what I saw. Kathy just bought this house and is in the process of moving down here from up north. She says she's used the ring camera to keep an eye on her property while out of town. And so far, she's only seen raccoons at night, but this was no raccoon. I just couldn't believe my eyes. I had to watch it three times. I said, is this a bear in Florida? And when I zoomed in, I said, that's definitely a bear. Kathy says she alerted PGA National Security right away and posted the video on social media to help get the word out. I have never seen a bear. I, I said, I go to Florida. I said, and there is a bear in my driveway. I couldn't believe it. Some neighbors say they're not too concerned. Ted Rowan's wife told him about the sighting on Thursday. And she said to me, I don't want you walking the dog late at night. I said, Jane, my biggest concern is coyotes, not bears. As for Kathy, she's still excited to move into the neighborhood, but will not forget about this bear anytime soon. I'll be a little leery, put it that way. <laughs> My husband will be taking out the garbage, that's for sure. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission confirms the bear is a juvenile black bear, and FWC officers say they'll be doing outreach in the area to let everyone know how to avoid any conflicts with it. FWC officers also remind everyone that if a bear has no access to food, it will move on quickly. So be sure to secure all food sources and never feed a bear. And the FWC says they don't plan to lay, uh, to lay any traps for the bear because they say that bear was not involved in any conflict and appears to be on the way to leaving the area on its own. Reporting live in Palm Beach Gardens, Steve King, WPBF 25 News. All right, Steve, thank you. We have had several reports of bear sightings in our area this summer. Here's some advice from Florida Fish and Wildlife. If you happen to come across a black bear, if a bear comes into your yard, FWC says you should safely attempt to scare the animal. You want to let the bear know it's not welcome. So from that safe location, not too close, wildlife officers say you should yell or hit some pots and pans together or both. The key is to be loud. They remind you, you can shoot paintballs or use bear spray, even a slingshot. They're all allowed under FWC guidelines. Then once the bear leaves, make sure there's nothing in your yard that might be attracting the bear, like Steve mentioned, food or trash it can get into. If you see a bear, call the Wildlife Alert hotline. That number is there on your screen. Let me read it for you. It's 888-404-3922.